I really don't have time. I am too old and unavailable for conversations like that. What am I benefiting? I'm not going to fight to get into my genes. I am too old to do to be doing the gene junk. To sit and talk about, oh my God, your dress is so beautiful. Oh my God, how about that weather? Please. What am I going to do with the bare minimum? What is bare minimums going to do for me? Thank you so much for the invite, but I unfortunately won't be able to make it. Why I won't be able to make it is none of your business. I am not trying to make you comfortable with the fact that, you know, by lying. Okay, I'm not going to be like, oh yeah, I remember that. I don't. I'm too old to sleep in makeup. Why are we doing that thing? I will do everything in my own time. This fear of missing out, I need to do it, I need to do it because everybody's doing it, too old, too unavailable. Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another video. Thank you so much for being here as always. Thank you very much for choosing me over and over again. Please make sure to subscribe to the channel and also like this video. Let's try and get the videos to over a thousand likes. It really does help me. If you haven't liked the previous videos, please do that. Please do that. Um, really, really excited today because I'm going to be filming one of my favorite videos to film. The things that I am just too old and too unavailable for. I'm very much unavailable for these things. And I haven't done one of these ones in quite a while. And I'm really excited to do it. So let's have some fun. Let us talk about some of the things that I am too old for. Also, I have a membership space. If you are keen on joining the membership space, it's a really good time over there. It's a really, really good time over there. Actually, yeah, it's a really, really good time over there. And if you can't be a member and maybe you want to just throw in a thanks here and there, there is a thanks button and where you can just throw me an easy 20 bucks or an easy 15 bucks, whatever it may be, I would really appreciate it. It really does go a long way to helping me with the channel and to helping me create more content. So thank you so much for being here. Let's get into the things that I just personally feel that I am too unavailable and too old for. Are you ready? Let's go. First things first, conversations that teach me nothing. Like honestly, I, ch I, I don't... That's why for me personally, mingling is just not one of my favorite things to do. I don't like to mingle. I was at an event two weeks ago as I'm recording this now. And I literally got there. There were people chatting, having a good time and this and this. And I was there by myself. Okay. Often a lot of the times I get invited by myself unless I'm they tell me that, yeah, you can bring a plus one. Then I'll probably come with a friend or my sister. But I went to this event and the whole time I was there, I got there by myself, took a welcome drink, stood at my own little corner, did my own little thing, was filming clips and all of that, went outside, sat at my own table until someone said to me that, um, hey man, let's chill together because I'm here alone, you're here alone. And that whole time, the conversation was so tintillating. Okay, never mind the fact that she was older than me and I really enjoyed learning a lot. She was American and, and, and we had this amazing talk where she was telling me about some of the projects that she's done and the people did it and we were talking about life, love, careers, business. Those are the kind of conversations that I want. So I do not want to sit and talk about, oh my God, your dress is so beautiful. Oh my God, how about that weather? Please, please, man, get out of here with that. I'm not interested. I really couldn't care a damn. I do not have time for conversations that teach me nothing. I want to be able to learn something about you or something about life, business, making money, anything. As long as making money is on that list, I love it for us. I love it for us. Um... So yeah, continuous moments of saying sorry does not mean I will normalize your bad behavior. I am too old to normalize bad behavior and just say that, oh, you know what? She's my friend, so it's fine. Or he's my man, so it's fine. I don't have time to normalize that kind of behavior. Listen here, when I say, if you do not want me cutting you off, 
Stop being badly behaved. That's all it is. Just don't behave badly. It's one thing you can you can you can um, uh, do something once off and I'll be like, hey man, nah man, check yourself. What's wrong with you? No. But then if I'm gonna go to a restaurant with you and you're rude to the service staff and you're and you're just really a rude person to be around, I don't want to be around you. I am too old to normalize bad behavior, whether it comes in the form of a partner or a friend or a sibling or a family member or whatever i am not i am not too old to be petty and actually cut you off but i'm too old to normalize that kind of behavior you can catch me outside um, with that. so personally for me i'm too old and unavailable to accept the bare minimum yeah, but not the bare minimum. Whether it comes from a relationship, whether it comes from a friendship, whether it comes from whatever, I am too old to accept the bare minimum. If you are, are going to just call me once every three weeks and then say that we're friends, that's bare minimum behavior. I talk to my friends every couple of days. I don't expect to be talking to them every single day because we got things to do, we are grown. We're too old to constantly be sitting around on our phones and chatting and talking about how we, uh, we went to this event and we saw this guy and that girl and this and this and, and gossiping. No, we're too old for that. However, I am not too old to cut you off when I realize that you're just giving me the bare minimum. What am I going to do with the bare minimum? What what is bare minimums going to do for me? How am I going to 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 to, to capitalize off of bare minimum behavior? What is it going to do for my life, my growth? You know what? What no? Get out of here, man! No, man. Uh, I'm I'm. You know you know you know. I love saying this. I'm too old to go out when I don't want to. And I, I, I get invited to places. This is kind of weird for me because I'm an introvert and I really don't like going out personally. Personally, I'm quite happy right here where I am doing this, which I am doing with you guys right now. But personally, I don't like going out. So I'm too old to go out when I don't want to. So you can invite me somewhere. I'm not gonna come back at you and say I'm sick. I don't feel well. I'm just not gonna. Oh, thank you so much for the invite, but I unfortunately won't be able to make it. Why I won't be able to make it is none of your business. But I just, if I don't wanna go, that's reason enough. That is explanationatory. That's explanatory enough. I'm not going to go out if I do not want to. If there is something in my system that says don't go out today, if I don't need to do it, I'm not gonna do it. Period. Listen, I am too old, okay, and too unavailable for you to be disappointed that we've met before and now I don't remember you. And now, so we met once or twice, okay, and I don't remember meeting you. I'm not, why are you mad? Why are you mad? Like if we met once, this is the craziest thing is that I've come across so many people that have met me before or saw me at an event or saw me at some occasion and we may have had like a two minute chat. You know what I mean? We, we could have had a little riffraff mingle chat session. Mingle is the key word here. So we had a mingle session, which I probably didn't want to come to honestly, but you know, we're in a public place. I, I'm going to act publicly and be a decent human being fine but if i do not remember meeting you and then you're gonna feel some type of way about it two streets like catch me uh, listen nah we're not open nah i am not trying to make you comfortable with the fact that you know by lying okay i'm not gonna be like oh yeah i remember that i don't I don't. I will literally say, oh my God, we did? Really? What did we talk about? I'm so sorry. I don't remember because I don't remember. So if now you're going to be like, oh my goodness, I'm so disappointed she didn't even remember me. Why are you disappointed? I'm not living to make you happy or comfortable with me or what I say. Okay. So if I do not remember you, I really just genuinely don't. And I'm sorry that I don't, but I don't. So rather than lie about the fact that, oh yeah, I remember. Um, 
Yeah, I do. Oh, yeah, I don't. I'm too old not to dress for comfort. Do you understand what I'm saying? I will dress for comfort all day, every day. You will never catch me in anything tight unless it's a bodycon dress. And it's tight to a point where I still can breathe. Okay? <laughs> okay? I, it's not going to be that tight where I can't even sit down. I can't maneuver myself. I'm not going to fight to get into my jeans. I am too old to, do, to be doing the jean jump. You know the denim jump where, where in our 20s, it, like, oh my God, I look so great in these jeans. Oh, my bum looks so great in these jeans. I'm going to wear them and then fight for your life to get into them. I'm too old for that. No, no. Right now I'm wearing, I'm wearing slacks. I'm wearing slacks. I wear slacks all the time. I'm in slacks every single day. If I can help it, I'm in slacks. I go to work, I'm in slacks. I'm, 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 I'm home, I'm in slacks. Okay, if I have a meeting at work, then I'll, I won't be in slacks. But... If I know I'm at no meetings all day, I'm, I'm, work, I'm at work with my colleagues, no nah, man, I'm in slacks. If I'm meeting my clients for coaching sessions, I'm in slacks. Because what is important, it's what's coming out of here. So what's coming out of here is me, it's my personalia, it's my all of that. I don't have time to be in tight things all day, every day. This is why every time when I would watch This Body Works For Me, I'm like, damn, do these girls dress like this every day? It could never be me. I could, I, I, I just can't. I am not 22. Maybe that's why I, I, I can't relate to it. But even at 22, I couldn't. I couldn't. I don't understand being in tight things and so uncomfortable. Like people who, who manage to chill in denim. Like you, all day. Okay, all day, every day. How? How do you manage that? I was sitting on the couch. I literally sat five minutes on the couch yesterday in my jeans because I had just come back from somewhere. And I sat down and I'm like, what, what am I doing? And I had to get up and put on some slacks because that's what I do. I'm too old for that. Listen, I'm too old to be shit talking about other people. I'm too old. I am too old to listen to shit talk about other people directed towards me. I am too old to give shit talk about other people. Nah. If I said something about you and you're sitting here and you're watching me like, I tell you lying because you didn't said something about me. I wasn't shit talking. I was telling the truth. Yeah. Maybe you got to look at you. <sighs> yep. Maybe you got to look at you. Because I, 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 I can tell you for free. That I'm not gonna sit here and shit talk you, no. But if you were badly behaved on a certain day, and you saw me and I saw you, and you acted like you did, you don't even know who I is. Sharp. If I'm telling somebody about you, I'm like, I know I saw her, sning ning, and she acted like she didn't know who I. I'm not shit talking you. I'm telling the truth. That's exactly what happened. Suppose that's exactly what had happened. So what we're not going to do is shit talk other people. I don't have time to shit talk other people. I don't have time to sit here and listen to you gossip about other people. I don't have time. I really don't. We can sit if you're trying to share some information about some, something that somebody did that hurt you or whatever that made you feel some type of way. That's fine. You're not shit talking. It made you feel some type of way. Fine. But if you're going to sit here and tell me that, oh, that girl, she's, oh, that girl, look at how she's dressed. I don't like how she's dressed. Oh, that girl goes around sleeping with men all the time. Oh, she changes this. Hey, I don't have time. I really don't have time. I am too old and unavailable for conversations like that. What am I benefiting? What am I benefiting by having that kind of conversation with you? What is it technically that I'm benefiting? Because it's another. Yeah, this is this is this is a good one. I'm too old to be experiencing FOMO. Nah, over anything. Like the other day, uh, I started seeing that uh, uh, some uh, was it? Uh, what was it? The other day, I saw that uh, Jamelli had re-renovated, right? The the, the 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 restaurant and all of that, and uh, and I saw it online and whatever. And uh, then I started seeing lots of pictures of people going to Jameli, right? Lots, relatively in short spaces of time. A couple of days later, someone else has gone. A couple of days later, someone else has gone. They've taken pictures at the infamous steps, right? Beautiful. I saw what it looks like. I'm like, oh my God, that is beautiful. Do I have fear of missing out? Do I now want to go immediately? No, 
I am too old. No, no. More than anything, I will actually wait. Go, 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 go. Then once it stables, it settles down, then I will go. Then I will go. Will I take a picture there by the steps? Doubt it, doubt it. Uh, no. I, I think that's the standard uh, uh, picture that shows uh, the peoples that you were at the, the Jamels. But uh, me personally, no, no. I will go one time. I, I do want to see it. I think it looks stunning, right? So I do want to see it. I will go. But to be experiencing FOMO, like, oh my gosh, she's picking up this bag. Oh my gosh, this shoe is trending and everybody has it. Oh my gosh, this, this, this. Oh my gosh, FOMO, uh, some show is on now and everybody's watching it. No. I will do everything in my own time. This fear of missing out, I need to do it, I need to do it because everybody's doing it, too old. Too unavailable. My couch, it's giving me really, you know, the only FOMO I have right now is to sit on my couch. But I can't because I'm working today. <laughs> Another thing, I'm too old of not, what? Of not. Another thing, I'm too old for not taking care of myself. And I'm talking about in all aspects. Do you understand what I'm saying? Not going to the dentist. Some of you sitting here watching this, okay? Yeah, Felicity, yeah, yeah, Dipu, Luen, 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 Chantel. Some of you sitting here, right? Uh, some of you sitting here haven't been to the dentist in five years. You've never set foot in the dentist. I'm too old for that. I'm going to the dentist at least twice a year. I'm getting my wash. I'm getting my checkups. I'm getting my everything done. I am too old not to look after my skin. I'm too old not to, 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 to I'm too old to sleep in makeup. Why are we doing that thing? On top of the fact that my sheets are white. <laughs> but why are we doing that thing? Why are we sleeping with makeup on? I am too old just to have a one one step skincare routine. Never that. There's an eye cream, there it's a serum, there it's a moisturizer, there it's air. You know, there's all those things. There it's a spray toner. There it's a this that, that's me. That, yeah, man, that stuff. I'm very much enough of age to, to be doing those kinds of things. You know? I'm too old not to be taking care of myself physically. I can't be sitting and eating burgers all day, every day. Absolutely not. I might not be going to the gym. I might not be moving my body as much as I used to. Yeah, but then I make sure that I watch what I eat. I make sure that I look after myself. I, I make sure that I move my body regularly. I'm too old not to be looking after myself. This, this, this business of just winging life. Today is a pega, who sang a pega, who sang a pasta, who sang a pizza, who sang My stomach would be like, what is go Where are the greens? Where are the lettuces? Huh? Where's the quinoa? Seems like you're eating pasta every day. What's going on? I'm too old not to be looking after myself like that. No, no, ma'am. Here's the next one I just thought about right now. I am too old to be getting blackout drunk. You're gonna blackout. Blackout. Where, where I can't even remember what I did the next day. No, 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 don't do that, because at some point, now you have to remember what you said to somebody. Now you don't remember the fact that you insulted somebody. You don't remember the fact that you said some really foul stuff to somebody. You don't remember because you were blackout drunk. No. My body is not going to function the next day. Nothing is going to come right. The following day, actually not even the following day, the next two, three days, nothing is going to come right. My body is just going to be like, what was your plan? Did you achieve what you were looking to achieve by making sure you got blackout drunk? What is that? I actually physically, if I drink a little bit over the limit that I would typically drink, I physically cannot drink the following day. I physically can't stomach the taste of alcohol the following day. So I really don't understand people who do. Blackout drunk. Go and now libates, oh libates, nix, 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 oh libates. Oh, what happened, Mobani? Ah, 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 yo. I'm too old to fix bonds that I didn't break. If I didn't break it, I'm not going to fix it. Why? If I want to fix it because I broke it, I will fix it. But if I feel like I did not fix, I did not break this bond, I really didn't. 
I'm, go I'm not going to fix it. I didn't, what, what do I have to do with the fact that you and so-and-so are not getting along? Now all of a sudden it's my responsibility to get you guys together and do a whole intervention. No, 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 no. My parents don't get along and then now they, they, they want to try and put me in the middle. I am too old to fix bonds that I did not break. I didn't break them. Much like friendships, much like relationships. If I did break it, I'll work on fixing it if I choose to. That's also if I choose to. But I'm not going to fix something I didn't break. I am too old to impress your friends or your family. If they don't like me, they can join the long line of people who do not like me. That's fine. That's it's wonderful. You don't like me, shop. I am not going to go out of my way to impress my friends' parents, my friends' siblings, my friends' whatever. I am too old to impress your family or your friends. So you may have other friends that are not friends, that I'm not friends with. That's cool. I'll meet them. Hey, what's up? Whatever, whatever. I'm not trying to have them be comfortable around me. If they're not, they're not. Period. Point blank. Amen. Amen. It's, it's like that. Be like that sometimes. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Be like that sometimes. If they don't like me, crunch up. I got no problem. Mara. I'm too old to be trying to impress them. Even with my man's, uh, 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 um, uh, my man's family, my man's friends. No, I'm just going to be me. If they do not like me because my eyes are too close together, my hair is looking a little bit nappy, uh, this, they don't like that. That's it's fine. That's it's fine. It's fine. As long as you like me, wonderful. I'm not going to be going out of my way to get your family to like me. There's always going to be people who do not like you. So they can join the line. No, I'm too old. I'm too old, Sinta. I'm too old to be worried about what your parents think about me, what your friends think about me, what your... Nah, nah, I'm too old. I, really, they don't like me. Amen. The line is turning around the corner. There's many people who do not like me. There are people that are watching this right now and don't like me. And they hate watching me. Wonderful. Glad to have you here. While you're at it, can you just like the video? Or oh, I know you're not. I will like it. Eh. <laughs> there are people who genuinely hate watching me. And I, I, it's cool. It's cool. It doesn't change the, the price of bread. It really doesn't. But it's cool. Um, I'm too old for people who feel like they're better than everybody else. Ooh. <laughs> and when I tell you I attend a lot of functions where people will spew stuff they'll talk and try to sound posh and try to sound better than everybody else and try to look better than everybody else look down on people if there's one thing that my mother taught me is humility it does not matter what you have what you don't have even my father actually what you have what you do not have you are humble you stay Humble, whether that person has more or less than you, whether they are better than you statistically or not better than you, it's fine. Humility. I cannot stand people who seem to think they're better, and you can see it. If you are really good at reading nonverbal communication, oh man, I study that at school too, so. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But if you are really. Oh, okay. If you are really good at reading non-verbal communication, you will see people who feel like they're better than others. You'll see them. You'll just watch. Mm, okay. Curl. Curl. It's one of the real big reasons why I don't like mingling and I don't like in, in events and social functions because I can see this, right? People who, who feel like, oh, I'm dressed better than you. Oh, I look better than you. Oh, I whatever. You, you may. You may. But scuba snacks, eh? Scuba snacks, I'm Hi, man. Scuba snacks, eh? Just treat people the same. What is the problem? What are you going to benefit by looking down on other people? What are you going to benefit? Nothing. Listen, I'm too old for not making me time for myself. Me time. Eh, me time is the standard. Yeah, in this, in this year house. This house, the house of me, me time is a standard.
I can literally, I was telling Lucia the other day, I can literally go to a, um, a, a restaurant that is next to her house. But if I have not planned to see her that day and I am there by myself because it's my me day, it's my solo date day and I've wanted to go to this restaurant and it happens to be by her house, I'm not going to call her and say, listen, I'm here, come through. Why? No. 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 I'm not going to do it because it's my time. It's my time. I can literally pass by my parents' house because we live close to each other. I can pass by my parents' house and go to the res a restaurant on their side and not even tell them I'm there. Why? My father has caught me so many times and taken pictures of me and my car or me walking out of my car and walking into a restaurant only to find he's in the same vicinity at maybe a different restaurant or whatever and he sees my car and he'll say, what are you doing here? I'm like, I'm on Sumita. Oh, okay, well, I'm at this restaurant. I'm like, okay, have fun. Good? Good. No, I'm too old. <laughs> yeah, I'm too old. Bliss. Yeah. Bliss. Listen, I'm too old to fight you to prove a point. Debating with you to try and actually prove my point? No. If you feel like one plus one is 11, it is. Of course it is. What do you mean? <laughs> if you feel like one plus one is 11, why has the world not woken up to your brilliance? That's me. I am too old to argue you to prove a point. If you feel like this is your point and you are right, you are absolutely right. Even though I may know in my head that you're wrong. Okay? If you feel that at the end of the day, Cyril Ramaphosa, okay, is the president of Uganda. Wonderful. Of course he is. What? So, uh, I mean, I knew that. And if you are willing to go to town to justify the fact that Cyril Ramaphosa is the president of Uganda, I am with you. I am on the bandwagon with you. I'm not going to argue somebody to prove a point. Just to show you that, no, I disagree, whatever. I will disagree with you and try and show you why I disagree with you. But if you're still going to be like, no, no, that's not actually it. That's not it. Of course, you're right. Of course. It's not it. What? Who am I? Who, who do I think I am? <laughs> and the last one is, I'm too old to split the bill. I'm too old. I don't know if I said this before, but I'm going to say it again. Well, I understand when I am Shanti. I'm going to say this again. I am too old to split the bill. I'm not going to split the bill. No. If I'm, with, if I'm with girlfriends and there's three of us, we're splitting the bill three ways. Do you understand what I'm saying? Three ways. Okay. Not because, no, we'll split the bill. I will pay for what I ate. So what I ate is 300 bucks. And then what you ate is, is 800 bucks. Hey, Amen. Split the bill three ways, man. Split the bill three ways. I know sometimes that sucks. I really do know sometimes that sucks. But then again, you also have to comprehend the fact that you're out with other people. You are not going to drink. Well, you're not going to drink the way you normally drink or order ridiculously expensive things on the menu when you know that you and your girlfriends are going to be splitting that bill. Be sensible, right? But if I'm out with my sister, are you handling the bill or am I? Cool. Uh, if I'm out with um, Diesel, are you handling the bill or am I? Cool. But this business here, every time I'm a little split, you already build it 50-50. I'm too old to split the bill. The only time I will split the bill is with if I'm with girlfriends and we're splitting it via the number of people that are sitting at the table. So if the bill is 2,000 rand, we're splittering, we're splittering, we're splittering it three ways. That's it. That's it, that's it, that's it, that's all it is, that's all it is, that's it. Man, I'm too old for this conversation right now because at this point, we know that it's the truth. Everything that's been spoken here is facts. And because everything that has been spoken here is facts, I think the right thing to do would be to like the video. Why aren't you liking the video? Why haven't you even liked it? Why did you allow yourself, okay, when I'm a sabbat, why did you allow yourself to get this far? Lerato. Why did you allow yourself to get this far and not, and not like the video? Why? No, that's not right. Do the right thing. 
All right, just like the video. <laughs> Please like the video. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And if you did, like and subscribe to the channel. If you did, if you'd want to go a little bit extra, drop me a super thanks or a thanks or whatever it may be. Or join the channel membership space. I really would love you over there. There's always extra bonus content on there that my members love eating up. And it's actually like decent, proper conversations. Like it's, it's real conversations, but it's also a good time here and there. So thank you so much for watching this video. Video. as always thank you for choosing me over and over again but i am gonna go now i'm too old for this conversation now i'm too old until the next video thank you see you soon be kind to yourself and be kind to others i'll talk to you soon sayonara